What does the liver do? You wouldn't believe me if I told you. Try us. Detecting the early signs of liver disease is crucial because the earlier a condition is identified, the more effective the treatment can be. Welcome back to the Longevity Deprocess channel. In this complete guide, I'm going to share 11 signs your skin may display in liver disease, and then, as a bonus, explain why these changes occur. Why is the liver so important? Think of it as a massive factory that works tirelessly to keep your body functioning smoothly. The liver plays a pivotal role in digestion by producing bile, which aids in breaking down fats and enhancing nutrient absorption. It also assists in detoxifying your body by removing toxins, ensuring you stay healthy. Additionally, the liver is essential for producing blood clotting proteins, which helps stop bleeding when you injure yourself. Recognizing these signs early is crucial for prompt intervention and better health outcomes. As an extra bonus, I am including a section on some of the significant causes of liver disease. For now, let's dive into the signs your body may display when dealing with liver disease. Sign 1 of liver disease itchy skin itchy skin oh, no. all over the body can be a distressing sign of liver disease, especially when scratching does not provide relief. This persistent itching, known as pruritus, is often unaccompanied by any visible rashes. Upon examining the skin of a patient presenting with such symptoms, there may not be any obvious skin abnormalities. The underlying cause of this intense itching is often linked to liver dysfunction, which leads to a buildup of toxins such as bilirubin in the bloodstream. Normally, these substances are processed and expelled from the body, but with liver disease, their accumulation can lead to skin irritation. This pruritus is a common manifestation of liver disease and may precede more overt signs of liver dysfunction. If you or someone you know experiences persistent itching without apparent cause, it is advisable to seek medical evaluation, as it may indicate underlying liver issues that require prompt attention. Oh, a quick favor. We'd greatly appreciate it if you can subscribe and like. This helps the YouTube algorithm recognize the value of our content and share it more widely. Sign 2 of liver problems xanthomasis. Oh no! Significant indication of liver issues manifests as xanthomas characterized by yellowish, raised bumps or plaques on the skin. These small, fatty deposits may surface across various body areas, notably around the eyelids, hands, feet, arms, and elbows. Their presence signals potential disruptions in the body's cholesterol processing mechanisms. Xanthomas are associated with liver dysfunction because of the liver's pivotal role in regulating and metabolizing cholesterol. When the liver fails to function optimally, cholesterol levels in the bloodstream can elevate, leading to the deposition of cholesterol in different skin regions. This accumulation ultimately gives rise to the development of xanthomas. Moreover, these elevated bumps might also indicate a genetic disorder called familial hypercholesterium, marked by high cholesterol levels inherited within families. This genetic trait highlights the critical role of the liver in regulating cholesterol levels for overall health. In conclusion, the appearance of xanthomas warrants attention, as it could signal underlying liver problems or genetic predispositions. If you notice these yellowish patches on your skin, consulting a healthcare professional for a comprehensive assessment and suitable intervention is recommended. Sign 3 of liver issues bleeding or bruising easily if oh no. Frequent indication of liver problems is heightened susceptibility to bleeding or bruising. The liver is pivotal in manufacturing clotting factors necessary for halting bleeding. When liver function is compromised, there could be a shortage of these clotting factors, leading to prolonged bleeding and increased vulnerability to bruising from minor traumas. Moreover, liver disease can diminish the synthesis of albumin, a vital protein responsible for preserving the strength of blood vessels. Consequently, weakened blood vessels are prone to rupture, leading to bleeding. Additionally, liver disease can trigger a buildup of toxins, heightened inflammatory markers, and deficiencies in various vitamins, all of which heighten the risk of bleeding and bruising. This combination of factors renders individuals with liver problems more susceptible to nosebleeds, bleeding gums, and inexplicable bruises on the skin. If you notice an increase in the frequency or severity of bleeding or bruising, it is important to seek medical advice for a proper diagnosis and appropriate treatment, as these could be signs of liver dysfunction or other underlying health issues. Sign 4 of liver disease depitrans contracture Oh no! Dupister contracture is a hand condition that can make it difficult for you to fully straighten your fingers. It involves the thickening and tightening of layers of tissue, called fascia, in your palm and fingers. 
This process can create nodules and cord-like areas in the hand, forcing your fingers into a bent position. In liver disease, there can be an excess buildup of collagen, a primary component of the fascia. This buildup can contribute to the thickening and tightening of the fascia, which in turn can lead to the development of Dupuytren's contracture. The condition is also linked genetically, meaning it can be inherited from family members, and you may develop it even if you have a perfectly normal liver. Dupuytren's contracture is also associated with other health conditions, such as diabetes and epilepsy. It is more common in individuals who smoke. If you notice difficulty in straightening your fingers or the presence of nodules in your palm, it is important to consult a medical professional for an evaluation and appropriate management. Understanding the symptom and its link to liver disease can help in identifying potential liver issues and seeking early treatment if necessary. Keep in mind that other factors such as genetics and other underlying health issues can also play a role in the development of Dupuytren's contracture. Sign 5 of liver disease Terry's nails Oh no. Terry's nails, an uncommon nail condition, could indicate an underlying liver ailment. This symptom manifests as a noticeable change in the appearance of your nails. The nails exhibit a ground glass appearance, where the white part of the nail bed enlarges while the pink or red portion diminishes, creating a distinctive appearance. These changes in the nails are thought to arise from issues with blood flow in the nail bed, along with low levels of albumin, a protein that is vital for maintaining proper fluid balance in the body. Low albumin levels can stem from liver disease, as the liver's ability to synthesize proteins diminishes. This, in turn, can affect the overall health of your nails and cause the characteristic changes associated with Terry's nails. In addition to liver disease, Terry's nails can also be linked to other underlying health problems, including kidney and heart disease. Therefore, if you notice these changes in your nails, it is important to consult a healthcare provider for an accurate diagnosis and appropriate management. Sign 6 of liver problems finger clubbing Finger clubbing is another potential sign of liver problems, though it is not unique to liver disease. Clubbing is characterized by a change in the shape and curvature of the tips of your fingernails and toenails, which become rounded and swollen, creating a bulbous appearance. This condition is often associated with an increase in connective tissue in the nail bed, as well as reduced levels of oxygen in the tissues of the fingers and toes. While finger clubbing can be indicative of liver disease, it may also be linked to other health issues such as heart disease for example endocarditis, chronic lung conditions for example chronic obstructive pulmonary disease or COPT, inflammatory bowel diseases, and infectious diseases. In fact, finger clubbing is a medical condition that often features in medical school exams due to its association with a wide range of potential health issues. Therefore, if you notice changes in the shape and appearance of your nails, it's important to seek medical attention. This is because there may be an underlying health condition that requires diagnosis and treatment. Early intervention can lead to better health outcomes and prevent the progression of any potential issues. Sign 7 of liver issues jaundice oh, no. prevalent indicator of liver problems manifests as a yellowish tint in the skin and the whites of the eyes. This discoloration arises from the accumulation of bilirubin, a yellow pigment formed during the breakdown of old red blood cells in the liver. Jaundice can occur due to various liver problems, including liver disease and some forms of cancer. It can also be associated with other conditions such as hemolytic anemia, a disorder in which the body breaks down red blood cells at an accelerated rate. While jaundice is a well-known indicator of liver issues, it can also be a symptom of other health problems, so it is important to seek medical advice if you notice any signs of yellowing of the skin or eyes. Early diagnosis and treatment can help manage the underlying condition and improve overall health outcomes. Sign 8 of liver disease spider nevi or angiomayone Oh no! Key signs of liver disease to look for is the presence of spider angiomas, also known as telangiectasia. These are small, red, spider-like blood vessels that appear on the skin. Approximately 10-15 of the population may experience them, and while they are sometimes linked to liver disease, they can also occur in pregnant women and women using contraceptive pills. The link to liver disease is primarily due to an increase in estrogen levels, which occurs because the liver is unable to effectively metabolize, break down, or process hormones. Recognizing the presence of spider angiomas can help in identifying potential liver issues and allow for prompt medical intervention. Sign 9 of liver disease Palmer erythemapple. Oh no!
Ulmer erythema is another sign of liver disease that can be recognized by reddish-pink discoloration on the palms of the hands. This symptom is caused by an increase in blood flow to the palms, which may result from changes in hormone levels associated with liver dysfunction. The hormonal imbalance that occurs in liver disease can lead to various alterations in the body, including those observed in the hands. The liver plays a crucial role in metabolizing and regulating hormones, so when it is not functioning properly, this can impact other systems in the body. Palmer erythema is often seen in conjunction with other symptoms of liver disease, such as spider angiomas small, spider-like blood vessels on the skin and jaundice yellowing of the skin and eyes. If you notice any of these signs, it is important to seek medical advice for further evaluation and potential treatment. These changes in hormone levels and increased blood flow can also affect other areas of the body and may be indicative of more serious underlying liver issues that need to be addressed promptly. Symptom 10 of liver disease gynecomastia Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. Notable symptom of liver disease is the development of breast tissue in men, known as gynecomastia. This occurs when higher levels of estrogen accumulate in the body, leading to the growth of breast tissue in males. Gynecomastia can be caused by hormonal imbalances associated with liver dysfunction, which may impact the body's ability to properly process and regulate hormones. While gynecomastia can occur as a result of liver disease, it is not exclusive to this condition. Hormonal imbalances can also arise during puberty, making gynecomastia relatively common in young males. Additionally, excessive alcohol consumption and the use of anabolic steroids can contribute to the development of breast tissue in men. Certain medications such as ranitidine and omeprazole have also been associated with the onset of gynecomastia. Therefore, it is essential to monitor any changes in breast tissue, particularly in men, as it may indicate an underlying issue that requires medical attention. I recall a patient who presented with a vague, weeks-long history of discomfort, which prompted further investigation into potential liver disease and hormonal imbalances. If you or someone you know experiences such changes, it is important to seek medical advice for a thorough evaluation and appropriate treatment. Sign 11 of liver problems ascites and distended veins and abdomen Oh no! What? If you observe an enlarged abdomen with visible distended veins, it could be a sign of a condition known as ascites, which can develop in individuals with liver disease. This excess fluid accumulation leads to a distended abdomen and visible veins around the area. The distended veins in the abdomen are sometimes referred to as caput medusae because the pattern of the swollen veins resembles the snakes on the head of Medusa from Roman and Greek mythology. Ascites and distended veins are significant signs of liver problems that require medical attention and proper management to address the underlying liver condition. And now let's look at what some of the causes of liver disease are. Our liver, a tireless hero within our bodies, silently performs a multitude of tasks, from filtering toxins in our blood to producing essential proteins and regulating digestion. However, this vital organ is susceptible to various threats, leading to a range of conditions collectively known as liver disease. Understanding the common causes of liver disease empowers us to take preventative measures and identify potential problems early on. Viral invaders, hepatitis A, B, and C are like hostile forces launching a direct attack on the liver. While hepatitis A often resolves on its own, chronic infections with hepatitis B and C can leave lasting scars on the liver, potentially leading to serious complications. Alcohol's toxic onslaught. Excessive alcohol consumption wreaks havoc on the liver's ability to process toxins. Over time, this relentless assault leads to inflammation, fatty liver disease, and ultimately cirrhosis, a condition where healthy liver tissue is replaced with scar tissue, hindering its function. A battlefield of toxins, everyday life can expose us to a hidden battlefield of toxins. Industrial chemicals, certain medications, and even some herbal remedies can overburden the liver, causing damage if not properly metabolized and eliminated. Fatty liver disease, a growing threat. Non-alcoholic fatty liver disease NAFOLD is a rapidly growing concern, particularly in developed nations. Unlike its alcohol-related counterpart, NAFOLD is caused by an excess buildup of fat in the liver, even in individuals who abstain from alcohol. This fatty infiltration can trigger inflammation and potentially progress to cirrhosis if left unchecked. The Hand of Fate Genetic Disorders Certain genetic predispositions can also play a role in liver health. Conditions like hemochromatosis, where the body absorbs excessive amounts of iron, can lead to liver problems if left untreated. Friendly Fire 
Autoimmune diseases. In a tragic case of mistaken identity, autoimmune hepatitis occurs when the body's own immune system, designed to protect us, turns its weapons on the liver cells, causing inflammation and damage. Biliary blockades. A dammed up situation. The bile ducts function as a vital drainage system, carrying waste products away from the liver for elimination. However, blockages in these ducts can cause bile to back up into the liver, leading to inflammation and potential damage. Early detection is key. While this list covers some of the leading causes of liver disease, it's important to remember that it's not exhaustive. The key to managing liver disease effectively lies in early detection and prompt treatment. If you experience symptoms like persistent fatigue, unexplained nausea or vomiting, abdominal pain, or a yellowing of the skin and eyes jaundice, don't hesitate to seek medical advice. By understanding the potential threats and taking proactive measures, we can safeguard this silent warrior within us and ensure its continued optimal function for a healthy and vibrant life. This is important. It's important to remember that your skin, being the largest organ of your body, often shows signs of what's going on internally, including with your liver. If your liver isn't functioning properly, it may give you hints through changes in your skin. Pay close attention to the signs we've discussed, but keep in mind that just because you experience one of these signs doesn't automatically mean you have liver disease. This video is not meant to cause unnecessary alarm for those who notice an isolated spider angioma, for instance. However, if you find yourself experiencing several of these symptoms and you consume alcohol heavily, it might be a good idea to schedule a conversation with your doctor to discuss liver function tests. Early detection is key because the sooner you understand your situation, the sooner you can take steps to address it. If you found this video informative or helpful, don't hesitate to explore our Liver Club playlist for more valuable content. Feel free to share your health journey in the comments section below, as we believe in learning from one another's experiences. Thank you for tuning in, and as always, I extend my best wishes for your continued health, wealth, and happiness. Remember, the key to vitality is in your hands.